when's the last time you actually had fun uh, building your network marketing business? We're just here at a, at a theme park. I'm just waiting for my little girl. She's going to come me down there with a water rapids in a minute. Um, I'm just enjoying something more my pace, which is the nature behind me. But it got me thinking about one of the important parts of attracting people to you. Do you know what that is? It's the fact that we represent in our industry the, not the anti-job, because jobs are very important. I mean, there's so many jobs that we couldn't live without, right? Emergency services, all those type of things. But a lot of people, 80 to 90% of your, every prospect who's ever going to be a possibility to join your business, they're not enjoying what they're doing. They're not passionate about it. They have somebody breathing down their neck, you know, the boss's son or daughter, right, who got that promotion they probably didn't deserve, or the suck-up who's, you know, kissing backside, and they kind of feel that pressure and stress, and they're like, man, I wish I could just do something which was fun, which injected some passion back in my life. So if you're building your business and it's always super serious, and I know it's tough, right, when things aren't going right, but you've really got to try your best to inject a little bit of fun and passion in what you're doing. If you're not enjoying yourself, people can see that. And why on earth would anybody want to join your business if it represents something they're trying to exit? Do, do you see that? Like we come to a theme park here today because it represents more fun than the average every day in our lives. So we want to come here and inject extra fun with this experience. Are you really representing that with your marketing, with your language, with your demeanor when you're promoting your network marketing business? Because people aren't really going to care so much about the compensation plan or the product, who your upline is, how many times you get on stage. If they look at you and go, well, man, that person just looks miserable just looks stressed out, looks like they're going to be annoying on my case all the time, or work, 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 I already have this, I want to get away from that. Isn't this supposed to be a solution? So next time you go and think about ranting on social media or being down in the dumps about your business results, try and look for something you can be upbeat about. The possibility of exiting a life that you don't like, the passion that you have for what you do in your spare time over what you're forced to do as a full-time career. Think about the progression that could happen, the people who you're around. There's so many things that you could look at and say, even though you may not be getting results, that's my little girl, <laughs> that you can enjoy what you're doing just like my little girl and her friend are right now and just like I am too. So just think about that moving forward. Start to put your best foot forward in terms of your mood and the passion and start to look what happens in terms of people being attracted to you. Look, we're even attracting the ducks. Even the ducks are gonna come and say hi. People can't help it. Fun, passion, it's infectious. But so is negativity. So just decide what it is that you're gonna do and put out there for your business. So anyway, I'm gonna go and pick my little girl up and a friend before they go wandering around. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope it's made you think about having some fun in your business. And if you're not having fun in your business, start to ask the question of why that may be and what improvements you could make. Maybe an incentive, maybe a goal, maybe reconnecting with your why, maybe looking at maybe getting on board with a different company, a different product, a different team. Whatever the missing piece is, is, don't you dare give up on your passion you've only got this one life and make sure other people can see that enjoyment coming through and you'll attract far better quality of people and build a team quicker so as always go create a day in a life that counts always have more desires and excuses i'll catch you on the next one and there's plenty more free training for you over at richardmathrew.com if you are an network marketer have a fantastic day and bye for now